This is how it opens. Finger through there. Come on in a little closer. Come around this side, I'll show you how the finger thing works. Finger through the knot, and then you pull that trigger on the other side. Just like that. So, like that. There's a magnet on this side to secure it when it's closed. So neither side rattles. It's very solid. When you don't pull the trigger, it's very solid, locked, open. These are held in by two half inch screws each. This is solid wood here, about three quarters of an inch thick. So as long as you've got half inch screws, you can mount stuff anywhere in there and it won't go through the other side and it'll hold well. Right here. Opens up just like that. You can do the same thing there. Oh, and down here, these open up. Four of them all around the bed. In the corners, the bed is held together with five, five through bolts in each of the four corners. Really solid. And the headboard and footboard come off just by pulling these out. And then you have three, three main pieces, the headboard, the footboard, and the bed itself. The bed is made primarily of cedar. Um, everything that's visible is cedar. The corners, the legs, are four by six. The tops are two by. The headboard and footboard are, uh, the, the big faces are uh, about three quarter. It's all tongue and groove together. Everything's glued with either epoxy or wood glue. The wood has a lot of character. Some really interesting knots. That's all cedar, of course, and it's all tongue and groove together. You can see some of the joinery there. And the back side, it's just raw cedar. These are 550 paracord. Of course, way stronger than it needs to be. There's some pocket screws up there, but it's also epoxied and then this piece wood glued so it's way overbuilt everything about it is very overbuilt very strong it's a little heavy in fact it's very heavy but that's a good thing <laughs> 